Welcome back to another episode of Beyond the Page, where we take a closer look at some of the features and workflows that make the Xerox Color C60, C70 the best printer for quality and versatility. In this video, we are going to demonstrate how easy it is to calibrate your printer or linearize your printer and calibrate your scanner on the C60, C70 color printer. Calibration is an important part of ensuring great image quality and consistency from job to job, page to page, every day. So, when should you calibrate your digital print engine? When you or your service rep have replaced a zero graphic component on the engine. When there has been an environmental change, increase in heat, humidity, etc. When you change media, maybe gloss or silk, or using a new special media. When running a color critical document, or if running the printer in multiple shifts for long print runs. You could run a calibration per shift or every eight hours. The good news is that calibration is easy and only takes a few minutes. It does not require any IT specialist or color expertise. Let's get started. Select Print Job 1. Next, select Paper. In this case, it will be Tray 1 and select the target to be Copy and Print Jobs. Then press Start. After you collect the test pattern printed on the media in Tray 1, follow the instructions as they appear on the screen. Place document on glass. Note the magenta is on the left side of glass. Add a few sheets behind the calibration sheet to block out any extra light and press start. A message will appear on the screen, calibration has been successfully completed and press confirm. For scanning calibrations, just repeat the steps using copy job one for stochastic or copy job two, most common at 200 LPI and follow the same on-screen instructions. And if doing two-sided copying, use the calibration for two-sided copy jobs. If you want to learn more on calibrations with the EFI servers, watch the video interview with Mike Rebusall, Xerox Production Color Business Manager and G7 Expert. That does it for another episode of Beyond the Page. See you next time.